All right. I'm Scott Berge with McQueen Emergency. I cover the states of North Dakota and Northwest Minnesota, uh, representing McQueen Emergency and Pierce. Uh, what we have here today is a custom pumper for the Watford City Fire Department. Uh, one thing that's really exciting about this build is this is replacing a 22-year-old Pierce that was purchased by the, by the Watford City Fire Department and this is uh, really exciting for, for them because this is their first custom pumper. Um, some of the, the highlights of this truck is they did go with a little bit different color scheme. Uh, the black over red with the uh, silver leaf inline and inla inlining and all of the, the graphics. Uh, pretty much anything on this truck that for the most part would normally be a chrome piece is a black piece. Um, and that's one of the really, really exciting things that, uh, about this truck and they're, they're really excited, excited about it. And, and honestly, you know, the fire chief is, is the most excited about this uh, thin red line grill here. Um, but uh, some of the other things, like I said, it's got rhino lining up on front here on the front bumper. We've got rhino lining on the scuff plates and on the wheel wells just to help with some protection from there. The truck is equipped with the uh, Haas alert system. So anyone using the Waze app or, or anything like that, they'll be alerted or any other trucks that'll have it will be alerted when this truck is en route to, to, a, to an emergency situation. This Enforcer chassis is uh, equipped with a six person cab uh, with command zone. Coming into the, uh, the crew cab as well here. So there'll be plenty of room for, for the firemen to, uh, to be riding around and en route to the, to the whatever call that they, they're, uh, they're going on. Um, like I said, they're, they're really excited to have a custom cab, a little bit more room, make it a little more ergonomic for, for the firemen. Coming over to the pump panel, uh, Watford City is in, is in the heart of the oil country out in North Dakota. Um, so there's a variety of different calls that this truck might be going on. Uh, with the Husky foam system, it's really going to make it more versatile for them to be able to have Class A foam on the truck and to be able to induct Class B or whatever uh, type of foam that they might need for any certain call that they may be going on. Coming back to the compartmentation, customer went with roll-up doors with an assortment of different compartment configurations with tool boards on each side to hold all their tools, adjustable shelving, and pull-out shelves. To the rear compartment, slide-out tray and an adjustable tray. One of the things the customer is really excited about with this truck is the black and red chevrons as well. Coming over to the other side, it mirrors the left side for the most part with the tool board, the adjustable shelves, and the pull-out tray. With air bottle compartments on each side as well for spare air bottles. With the cross lays, they did one inch and three quarter and one two and a half inch speed lay. Uh, one of the things that the customer decided to do that was a little different with this truck is add some blue lighting to their warning light package. So they've got blue lighting on the officer's side, red lighting on the, on the driver's side. The truck is equipped with FireTech high vis lighting. Uh, on the front and on the sides. You can see the two light bars up on each side with the black trim. And one thing that's really cool about this hive is uh, uh, brow light. It's got the clearance lights integrated right into the light bar along with a progressive switch so you can control the intensity of that switch as needed for the nature of the call. Thank you for taking a look at the Watford City Fire Department's uh, new custom pumper, and that's, that's the truck. <laughs>